Good morning and welcome back. I've left the gorgeous city of Lublana behind and heading north to the great outdoors. I'm really excited to be back in nature and back where I feel most comfortable photographing what I love, the mountains and outdoors. The nature so far is absolutely gorgeous and I've only spent one hour on the road. I'm currently heading to this place here. I'm sorry, I do not want to pronounce it. The Slovene language is really difficult. I don't want to make a fool of myself. It's an amazing valley. I'm super excited to go and just explore once again, be back in nature. Staying in a traditional log cabin tonight. I'm sure there's gonna be many, many compositions to be found. This is just a quick pit stop for lunch. After this, we're gonna get back in the car and go and explore this lovely valley that I can't wait to look at. So let's get going. Here I am back at the same location I was today. It is absolutely beautiful. This is just straight out of a postcard, this image. The leading line of the road going straight into the huge mountains in the background. There's cows in the foreground, a single lonely tree. It is absolutely perfect, the composition. I'm shooting with the polarizer, 18 to 135 at about 35 mil. It cannot get much better than this. Slovenia on the first day of this road trip has absolutely delivered. It is so, so, so beautiful here. Walking around exploring waterfalls, gorges, it is just absolutely gorgeous. I cannot stress enough how beautiful Slovenia actually is. This shot is such a simple composition. Anyone can look at this and know exactly what to shoot. It, like I said before, it's a postcard image. The only thing I'd love to do right now is probably have a drone and get a little bit higher because the road with this image is a little bit flat and it doesn't create a full leading line like I'd love. With the composition I have gone quite tight because the clouds are hovering just above the mountain and it has that mountain glow on it. It is absolutely brilliant. The hues in the red are absolutely gorgeous. And just off to the right, the clouds are just popping red. So I've gone tight with the composition, the single tree in the foreground. As I said, this composition is so, so simple to recognize. And I believe this image is probably gonna be one of the best shots I've got from this whole seven week trip. Absolutely gorgeous. As always, F11, two second timer. I have chucked a polarized because it is a little bit hazy right now. Just adds that extra pop in the red and also the clarity coming out of the mountains. So simple as that, 
two second timer. Here is the image. I hope you love it as much as I do. Woo! That is the image and that is on fire. Seriously, I've been to some amazing countries around the world and some amazing photography landscape countries. New Zealand, West Coast of America, Scotland, Canada, and do not get me wrong, that stacks up to some of the best views I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Honestly, Slovenia is beautiful. This is epic. It is really hard to capture in one photo, in a sentence, how beautiful this location is. It is postcard perfect, that's the only way I can put it. And do not get me wrong, where I was to tonight, the light, it just makes it even more beautiful. Being here tonight though, made me realize that it's not a sunrise photo. I was gonna come back tomorrow morning for sunrise, but the way the sun's setting in the summer, the way it's gonna rise will rise to the back and it won't give the same effect. So that is me done. I'm off to Lake Bled tomorrow for the next two days, which I'm super excited about. I've wanted to photograph Lake Bled for a very long time now. I've got compositions I want to work with. I'm really, really excited. Get to explore gorges, obviously photograph the lake, mountains, churches. I'm very, very excited. But tonight, that is all from me. Keep exploring, get out there, get off your chair, explore, adventure, travel the world, follow your dreams. Peace. Peace.